this vlog started out as just a normal vlog, a documentation of my day, what was going on on that Sunday, um, but it turned into something else in the end. We'd started off on the Sunday, which was the day after the night before. We'd had a few beers the night before. Lisa was feeling a little bit delicate. So I left her. I went over to get Jake from Lisa's mum. And I'm off to go and get Jake from his nan's. And then we're off to my mum's today to have a Sunday dinner because we uh, are well in need of that. And um, yeah, got a bit of a surprise today. Hopefully it'll work and uh, we can show you that. Uh, so yeah, gonna get to a little spud first and pick him up and get the rest of the day going. Let's go. I'd also just made this Top Gear style edit of me driving to get Jake, um, just using the GoPro and then editing it in Final Cut Pro with like a comic book effect. Wanted to make it look pretty cool and a bit dramatic. Made it. I picked Jake up from his nans, then we got back home, we left uh, Lisa at home again because she was feeling delicate and I went over to my mum's on the way, Jake lost his tooth. Oh, Jake's tooth just come out, how oh, did it hurt? No, not really. It hurt, he was just putting brave face on though for the camera. Turn off, turn camera. Is it, oh it's bleeding. Oh man, you right? No. <laughs> To hurt. <laughs> oh, there. dude. Oh. Don't use that, it's dirty. Let's go get oh, a tissue and get to nuns. Oh, that, one of the molars has come out. Oh, I don't like it. I don't like seeing you in pain, dude. <laughs> you alright? Say hello. Say hello. Well, that's bleeding pretty bad, man. Can you see it coming through? Yeah. Okay, let's get to nannies, wash you up. Then we got to my mum's and to my surprise, my auntie Jean, who is not officially my auntie, she's my mum's cousin, my second cousin, um, was um, at our house. She's just moved over here from New York where my mum has brought her back home from where she originally was and to put her in a care home because Jean is suffering from dementia. It's pretty fast moving she's struggling to remember short-term things she remembers who we are she remembers where she lived and um, it's just a little bit difficult at the moment but this is just a little story now from a normal vlog and this is what it turned into of the story of Jean and just a little bit of a background of what's going on she moved to New York in the 50s after meeting um, her husband in the war she's lived over there ever since she actually worked as Elizabeth Arden's personal secretary for the last 20 years of her life um, before Elizabeth Arden died. And so she's experienced a lot in New York. She's got a lot of friends over there. And while she was at her house, my mum made her call all her friends and just tell them that she was okay. This is a phone call of one of her friends that she spoke to while we were there. Yeah, yeah. Well, he's going to be delighted that you called. Well, next time you're over here, we'll get together. <laughs> okay, absolutely. That's for sure. That okay, is, hon. That'll be the reason why they come. We'll get there. Okay, hon. Lovely to talk. Okay, Bye. Well, Bye, hon. Bye. So, although this is a little bit of a story about dementia and how it affects people's lives, she's doing well. She's put on a lot of weight since she's been home. She's in a good place with surrounded by good people that are looking after her. She has still has her own independency where she has her own apartment, but it's just fully serviced and she's fully looked after food-wise, care-wise, 24 hours a day. So she's over here. She's come back now, and uh, we're all glad to have her over here. She's one of my favourite people of all time. And, yeah, she's a typical strong New Yorker, still very active, mid-80s, can walk and look after herself, no problem. Just It's just really, really unfortunate that she's debilitated in this way. And my mum has taken a lot on. She's She visits her every day. She's travelling to New York constantly, trying to sort out all her bank situation, the payment situation, money situations. She's selling her apartment in Central Park. And it's just a massive thing at the moment. But so this vlog sort of turned into a little bit of a story about Jean introducing you to Jean and hopefully she'll feature a lot more on this channel. I'm going to have regular contact with Jean because it helps people with dementia 
to have regular contact with people that they know stimulates their brain they need conversation they need stimulation so that's Jean she's a legend and this is just a story a little bit of uh, how uh, dementia has affected my family and the people around me so that vlog turned into a little bit of a a story about Jean and she's a wonderful person but yeah just how strange how you set out to do one thing and you start talking about another and it just made me realize that you're very lucky to have what you have you're we're all very lucky to be in a situation where we can experience life like this and you've got to make the most of every day because um jean's had a fan she's lucky she's had a fantastic life uh towards the end now it's getting a little bit more difficult but she's got family around her that um are doing the best for her and that are caring for her and uh in that way she's very lucky um and we're very lucky to have her as well but yeah, just wanted to share this story, I suppose, um, just to, for document records, if nothing else. And uh, hopefully she'll be around for uh, a long time yet. And yeah, I'll try and get an interview with her if I can and try and document, make the most of Jean being here and try and get as much information and experience from her as I can. But yeah, so that's a little bit of how dementia has affected our family. Uh, it's not it's not easy at the moment for my mom. She's doing a lot of work. She's lucky because she's just retired, so she's got the time to do it. That is it. If you if you've got any experience of that, or you have any problems with uh, relatives um, that have got dementia, I'll link some support channels down below that you can go and get information for. That's, uh, that's today's film. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in the next one.